Let's go. Let's go. Chapter 1039 of One Piece. Man, I'm I'm up early and I, I gotta go ahead and get this review out, man. Love this chapter. As always, before I begin, if you rock with your boy, go ahead and hit the like button after you get done watching the video. Subscribe to my channel for more content, anime content alike. Um, and hit the post notifications. With that being said, man, let's go. Already, based off my energy, you already know that I love this chapter. 10 out of 10. I'm going to tell you why. We're going to go all the way. First off, this is a battle chapter. Love, and, and, and not just any battle chapter. This battle chapter was... This, it gave so much to use this kid in law. Love this chapter. Man, oh, let's let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so like I said, I'm giving this chapter 10 out of 10. I'm, I'm giving it a 10 out of 10. So, you know, battle chapters are... There's two types of battle chapters in One Piece. There's like the battle chapter where they fighting, but there's no progress. You know, it's not going anywhere. And so it might be decent, you know, those chapters are typically for me like a seven to an eight, you know, you know, if done correctly, if done poorly, you know, maybe older don't really care about whoever they, you know, whoever's fighting, it might be a little bit lower, right? Uh, but this battle chapter gave progression, gave, you know, new abilities to kid, to, to, to law, to dialogue, everything was just, you know, popping. And both sides was giving it they all, Big Mom. Like, she was throwing out new attacks and things of that nature. It's like, it was amazing. But before I get into all that, let's start off at um, something that pretty much caught my eye, and that's Momonosuke. So, Momonosuke, of course, he's trying to save um, the island from, you know, essentially dropping down and and, it, and it's crashing and, you know, killing everybody. Um, but Momonosuke, he said he, he hear a voice. And so I'm, I'm guessing it's that giant elephant and maybe that giant big ass elephant is going to help Momonosuke push the island away um, so it won't, you know, cr crash down. Right. So that's something that and I, I feel like everybody kind of know that's what's going to happen. Like we already seen the elephant in past chapters coming and maybe that's like the lurking legend, you know, so it is what it is. That that part was pretty much interesting. But after that, for the most part, it was all about Big Mom versus Kid and Law, and that was something that I enjoy. So in previous um videos of mine, I talked about how you know Kid and Law could potentially lose or potentially win, and so I had a theory about like if Kid and Law loses or lose this battle. Uh, potentially maybe Zoro will figure out, you know, maybe they get Zoro back in the game and maybe he'll finish off Big Mom. But I, it, it, when I was talking about that, I was saying how how much that, that would look poorly on Kid and Law. And I will hope that Kid and Law will get the W. Now, of course, Big Mom, you know, we're we not 100% certain that Big Mom has, you know, beat the, beat, have, ended, you know, lost or whatever, um, but I'm pretty sure, I'm like 90% sure she did lose, but if she didn't, I don't know, that, uh, uh I just, I don't know, I, I think this is a perfect end for Big Mom, having Kid and Law take down Big Mom, because a lot of people, myself included, was like, on a, on a, Shaky side, like, I don't know about Kid and Big Mom. I don't know. I mean, I said Kid and Big Mom, but Kid and Law. I don't know about Kid and Law. I don't think they're going to take down Big Mom. So the fact that they did so much damage is magnificent. So let's, so, so starting off with the fight, man, you know, um, Based off of last chapter, Kid hit Big Mom with uh with his iron bull technique and whatnot. Um, but I find it interesting. And this kind of this was scaring me a little bit about Kid. Why? Because Big Mom, when she got up, she wasn't really worried about Kid attack. She got up talking about, man, that law attack um damaged you from the inside out. I'm like, oh snap. And she was praising law attack, like, oh, I don't want to get hit by that no more. Ooh. I won't get hit by that. You, you seen Big Mom arm like this. Now she used her ability, her soul ability, to essentially regenerate her um bones or whatnot. 
But Big Mom acknowledged that, yo, Law Attack does some damage, and I ain't trying to get hit by that. Skip that. And so for me, I was like, oh, so now my boy Law getting some credit. You know what I'm saying? He doing his thing. Um... But Big Mom was looking at a kid like, eh, that and I was like, oh, snap, they finna, they finna, they finna, man, it seemed like Law was doing, it. at that point in time, it seemed like Law was, was really holding it up, holding it up, but I knew that it was gonna give, um, Kid his moment when Kid and Law was talking, of course, they was arguing a little bit, you know, you know, that, that, that rivalry, um, between them is still going, but when Law said, you know, his next attack is going to be his final attack. I was like, okay, so they most likely going to... Kid is going to, you know, essentially finish off Big Mom, right? So, that's that's essentially what what the, the build-up of the chapter is about, right? So, after Big Mom, um, pretty much, you know, knock out, knock away the bull. Kid uses, I guess, his awakening to push used gravity gravitational pull to push big mom back so she could not escape um but big mom being big mom and then he was big mom being big mom because eustace kid was about to hit her again big mom like nah 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 she used whatever she was being pulled to and turned it around to prevent the attack and i was like oh snap okay big mom and then big mom start to Use an attack that you know we never seen before, and that attack looks similar to her mother. And that I ain't gonna lie, that attack was cold. And this this is why I like this chapter because both sides was we were seeing something new from both sides. You know, so both of them, both sides was like giving it they all, and you can tell Big Mom was really hurting. She was like, "Oh, I got better take care of these kids now, or it, it might not look too good for me." Right, so. Big Mom used this attack. It's a moving attack. It looks like her mother seems devastating. It's burning and destroying everything around them. Um, and then I believe Law used Strambles to you to throw a building on top of Big Mom and then strambled strambled away or whatnot for hit, for Law to essentially be standing on top of Big Mom. Right? Of course, Big Mom she she praising Law. She like, okay, youngster. Okay, youngster. Okay, now get up off me, youngster. Law, like, nah, nah, nah. Law uses his um his inner destructive destructive move. So whatever that move is that allow that his sword extend and it does internal damage to Big Mom, he used that but at a much 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 greater scale. I mean, he stabbed the sword into Big Mom and the sword went all the way through the island, hitting the sea. Whew, so Big Mom is in pain. Big Mom is feeling the after effects of what Law have done. Law is knocked off of Big Mom. Big Mom, like, I'm sick of you. He she was finna go and take Law out. But Eustace kid, I don't know. I I'm guessing whatever Eustace did, is it, it was like a beam. So I'm guessing like he it, it had to be like a magnetic beam shot at Big Mom. Because Eustace it, and that text seemed like it, it, it was the it was the finisher. So it basically saved Law. So as Big Mom was about to finish Law, Eustace is like um at the top. He's like at the top. Um and I guess he used the metal to condense this energy beam thing and he shot it at Big Mom. Once he shot it at Big Mom, you know, of course Big Mom is still acting cocky and all that, like you rents, but this is why I feel like Big Mom Big Mom is is this done? This is this is why because she was talking shit because that that's that's like the bad guy trope where they like you can't defeat me, you can't beat me, I'm I'm the top dog. All that kind of kind of remind me of um training day, you know, at the end when he was just screaming. He know is he know it's over. That beam hit Big Mom. Law talking this shit. He's like, man, your era is over. And then the chapter ends. 10 out of 10. I don't know what to say. This chapter was magnificent. I love this chapter for real. Um, like there's several chapters in One Piece that just gave me this hype. The Nico Robin chapter, the Zoro chapter, when the, the the five supernova chapters, you know, so many chapters so far in Wano have gave me that that goof that goosebumps. Like, oh, oh, oh. And I'm and 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 I hope 
Big Mom did not get, does not get back up next chapter. I really hope she does not. Because Law said this is his final attack. And Kid seemed like he used every single trick um, that he has. That, that beam was very powerful. It, it should have knocked Big Mom either unconscious or maybe knocked her out off the island. So hopefully Big Mom is done. Um, and to be honest, because if Big Mom loses lose to kid and law that's gonna kind of change the whole narrative because i believe a lot of people were talking about seeing um big mom in the next um arc el el bath i believe um the land of the giants and that still can be possible but her losing and if luffy beat kaido i would not see big mom as much of a threat you know if they do you know not see like, I don't want to say sound, make it sound like she's weak because she's not weak. You know, I'm just saying, like, I feel like Big Mom would be more careful of the straw hats if she faced them again. If that makes sense. Like, I think after this arc, put it this way. After this arc, Luffy, Kid, Law will receive respect from amongst the pirate world and the government. So people won't just be trying to throw hands with them out the blue, if that makes sense. So anyway, with that being said, I really enjoyed this chapter. Can't say that enough. Um, 10 out of 10. Um, again, if you rock with your boy, please continue to um, subscribe to my channel and things of that nature. Um, let's talk One Piece. I mean, let me know how y'all felt about the chapter. Um, what do you guys, what are y'all predictions um, about the, like, the next chapter? Like, What you guys think is going to happen? Is Big Mom done or is Big Mom going to rise? Whatever you think, please drop it in the um, comment section below. And again, rock with your boy. I rock with you guys. Rock with your boy. Um, appreciate you for um, staying and um, watching this video and things of that nature. And again, I look look forward to more content. Um, I believe I will be saw. I might review the entire Demon Slayer series and just give you guys my um, opinion about that once the series is done because it's just like two more episodes, so I may as well wait. But with that being said, thank you guys for staying tuned, for watching this video. And as always, you guys have a blessed one. Peace.